the UMass Hoops Insider with Derek Kellogg, brought to you by Coca-Cola. Welcome back. It's UMass Hoops Insider, the Minutemen in Philadelphia Saturday night for a matchup with St. Joseph's. 95-96 flashback time for us, and the Minutemen took that incredible undefeated streak into the middle of February in 1996. They were at 24-0 when they went down to Blacksburg, Virginia to take on Ace Custis and 10th ranked Virginia Tech. It was arguably the biggest game that Virginia Tech had ever had at Castle Coliseum up to that point, but it was Marcus Camby who stole the show. Let's take a look back, February 17th, 1996. Now everybody in the country knows that UMass is undefeated. What you may not know is only twice have the Hokies fallen. They are 19 and two. Well, the other night he did, 15 against LaSalle. On the jumper, under pressure, and Camby is stepping up early. He's got nine calling it for the Atlantic 10 today. Camby again. Dingle, great box out. Camby from Travieso, and that's 13 for the big fella. It's getting after you, and they steal the ball about almost eight times a game. Dante Bright, a great look. Easy again for Camby. He's seven of nine. And if you work hard enough, good things are going to happen. That's the third time today he's escaped right under the basket for a good look. 65. Virginia Tech beat up 91-88 in a tournament they hosted here. Camby, tough shot on the drive. He's got 23. Down to 20. He's Custis with help, so Camby turns the other way. Look at that touch. Wow. 27. Minutemen have proven once again they are the best team in the country by making good decisions, by stepping it up, by taking care of business one game at a time. Seventy-four, fifty-eight will be the final. 31 points for Camby, a dominating effort to help lead UMass to consecutive victory number 25. Virginia Tech would make March Madness and they would lose to eventual national champion Kentucky in the second round of the NCAA tournament.